Welcome, Holdings, to another episode of Fantasy Star 2. Let's enjoy the intro music, because it's so damn good. We should play it throughout the LP. Get started. Did a little bit of leveling as we can see. Cock only needs 160 points. Be careful out there. Watch out for dim titties. Alright, we should be back to our 720p window. You're welcome. But Game Corner, I want to watch Fantasy Star 2 in 4K. Little tough titty. You can eat a bag of dicks. These games weren't meant to be watched in even 720. This is back when we had big old fat heavy as fuck TVs that you couldn't even pick up without your dad help. The old tube TVs. So I did a little bit of power leveling, power leveling in the, uh, the tower that was kicking our ass. I forget the name of it. it started with an N. Uh, but we got TM from there. What's TM doing? I'm gonna go meet my father. Don't go anywhere. Hey girl, give me your money or I'll fucking kill you. I have nothing to give the likes of you. Why you? Chica! Ah! Father, kill him. Fuck you. Tim, oh, what have I done? You won't die alone. I'll fucking blow up. This is just one of the many tragedies which has come to pass as the world falls into turmoil. Someone must save us. I'm imagining that wasn't the guy talking because he exploded. We are going to save us. Stock and cock and knee. Alright. Maybe facing fi tougher monsters over here. Nope, never mind. Fire ants and bees knees. Gonna get their asses torn up. I did go ahead and buy Cock a another ceramic dagger. So he's wielding that bad boy. Dual wielding. Uh, got a couple levels each guy. Up to uh, 6700 Masetta. Stock has the res. So you can kind of see our stats there. We're going to be upgrading at this next town as well. Me, level 19. No job. Yep, typical kitty woman. No fucking job. Mooching off of stock and cock. But that's okay. She's hot. She's a hot kitty chick, so. As long as she puts out, we're game. Shit, four wasp. We need to upgrade them kitty claws. See? Give me that money. Low 
focused in mosquitoes. Those guys are no match for the party. There are insect bits and wings everywhere. All right, new town. This town is called Opta. The Biosystems Lab is located in the southern part of this town. Did he say Opta? Yeah, Opta. Star Mist cures your scars and Moon Dew revived your soul. The Biosystems Lab is controlled by Mother Brain. It cannot make mistakes. I wonder when peace will return to Moto. Oh, what's another brain? I remember those guys. They're from like that frozen planet. Say, have you heard of Star Mist and Moon Dew? They smell very good. I use them to bite my ass. I feel hungry. Systems Lab created the monsters as a lie. In the basement of the Biosystems Lab, I hear there's something most important. Even if those monsters are gone, Otis already been devastated. There's nothing we can do. The hole in the middle of the Biosystems Lab building leads to the horrible basement. It smells like shit down there. People in Alba are hungry all the time because they can't eat shit. I am Ustvestia, a musician. Do you want to hear me play? Oh, I get it. You want to learn to play the piano? Well, actually, I'm kind of busy right now. I've got to go. The hell was that? Gonna teach me piano? A dick. Let's go hit up that weapon shop. I'm oh, sorry about that. Sorry. Welcome. What the fuck do you want? All right. Um. Ooh. Yeah, scalpels and shit. Ceramic bar. That attack is going up pretty nicely. 97. Noise. He is kicking that ass now. Let's check out the armorer. Welcome to my shop. What can I do for you? Uh, well, let's see. Let's get a uh, fiber vest. Fiber gear. Sell our old shit at the item shop. Buy some dimate too. Oh, I 
can wear that over my gear. Over the coat, rather. That's cool. I wonder when peace will return to Motel. The biosystems lab has been creating plants which grow well even in land with a little rain. Fuck you just say. Oh, glorious mother brain, please save us! I want to be a musician. I heard there's a piano teacher in this town. Yeah, yeah, we know. We heard your bullshit. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. There's a knock at the door. How do you do? I'm Dr. Amy Sage. I heard that you're seeking to solve the mystery of the bio monsters. I will be glad to assist you, though I'm not much of a fighter. But I can heal wounds. Give me a new name if you wish, as a sign of closeness. Oh yeah. I see. What name would you be good for me? We haven't seen this character since... What was the game? <laughs> Earthbound, that's it. Fucking twat from Earthbound, she's back! I will call you twat. Let's check the roster. At the point where twat came in. A doctor from a normal home, specializes in both healing wounds and curing poison. Not strong in battle. Let's see how many members there are. If we want to regroup, well, let's get going. Who should we take into the party? Let's start our journey. That makes four of us. All right, stock, cock, and twat. And of course, knee. Let's also go save while we're here. I don't usually do silly names, but I kind of already started that ship. That ship has sailed when I named Cock. Rudo, Rudo Cock, so uh, yeah. We're just going to stick with it. Goofy names for the rest of the game. 35 points, alright. I'm afraid to ask what level she is. Fuck yeah, we're gonna adventure some more. At least 45 minutes more. I think we're gonna have to level her up, though. That's the problem. Uh, Jesus. Level one! Oh, God! Scheiser! Not to mention, we're going to need to uh, warp back. 
Oputa. That guy called it Opta. It's Oputa. Oputa. Who are you calling Oputa? That is a typo in the game. The greeter here doesn't know the name of his own fucking town. Yeah, there's no you there. Shit translation! This game sucks! Alright, anyways, let's get a twat equipped with some armor. You have to protect your twat. Ladies, can I get a hell yeah? I think also wear fiber gear uh, with the fiber cape. And she can dual wield scalpels. Alright, now we got an awesome healer. She can keep us up in battle once we get her leveled here. Now we're talking. I just want to go back to the tower and level her, really. Let's go see what kind of monsties we can find around here. She's only level one, so we probably shouldn't go to the tower yet. She's gonna get her ass beat, but we'll get her there. What I'll do is I'll do uh, a few fights with her, and then I'll pause the camera, do a little bit of power leveling. And then we'll cut back. It won't take too long to get her to level six. She's gonna get her first few levels pretty easily. Man, those new claws are sweet. We need to find a good little area. Oh, here we go. We need to get you a new sword, big guy. Wait a minute, how come the doctor isn't attacking? What'd I miss? Oh, she's in defense. That's probably a good idea right now. What? Knee touches Twat's wounds. The wounds are healed. Holy shit, she got three fucking hit points? Oh lord. Oh lord. I just got res.
It's like a good mix of semi-tough enemies, which are these guys, which aren't really semi-tough anymore, but the twat they were. And then there's a good little amount of stronger enemies, although I'd rather just fight some of those trees. They seem to be the best for experience. As long as they don't shoot twat, we'll be all right. I don't want to fight this giant bastard. He's too easy. He's not worth shit. Too experienced. Get the fuck out of here with that. I will walk over here. There we go. Touching me, twat. Lo locusta. Or a locust. Locust A. Locusta. I like locusta. It sounds cooler than locusta. Go, twat! What are you at? 16 fucking hit points now? Oh, she got a big seven. But no techie. All right, folks, I'm going to go ahead and pause the camera and continue to level. We'll be RB. All right. We're back. Did a little bit of grinding. Got twat up to actually level seven. Me went up a level two. She's level twenty now. Twat is level seven. All right, I can deal with that. I think stock and cock are still ten. That's how little XP she needed to get to seven. It still took a little bit of time though. Let's go back to Opuda. We need to hit up this biosystems lab. I'd like to do another hard save here before we leave. I use a save states of court a course alongside of this. Because I do not trust this shit. But only save states in safe places. As are all of my LPs. This one actually seems to work good though. <clears throat> Oops. Meant to click yes, good thing we saved. Alright, let's get going. Oh puta! See you later. Monsters do get stronger. I came over this bridge over here and went down and fighting mo mostly shit like this. Might as well have a uh, twat chip in. She can probably take a hit or two now. We'll see. I left her in defense mode while I grinded because she was so damn weak. Come 
Come on, you gotta hit. Well, that didn't much matter. Alright, got two steps. Oh, wow. Yeah, we might as well leave her in defense mode. She's better off not taking hits. Damn. She does have the G res. A more powerful heal instead of 20 hit points. I think it heals double that. All right, the bio systems lab. Looks like we're gonna need some dynamite. Oh, alien creatures. Oops! I gotta put Twat into defense! Oh! She killed something though! Oh goodness, what do I do? It's a 1 in 4 chance they might hit her. She helped. She did a whole whopping 8 damage and killed something. Got the jump on me. Uh, yeah. Stock. Learned a new technique, even. combat stuff we'll have to try out. Ah! Stocks have found an antidote. Shit. Being attacked by a giant purple fucking frog in a desert dick. Toters aren't too strong and neither are leechers. Right pit or the wrong pit?
Whoa! Check out the trippy yellow mushrooms, dude! Uh-oh. This fucker's got some hit points. Holy hell in the ham basket. We better kill these sons of bitches. I don't know what sack does. I need to look that shit up. Oh, well, apparently that is a sacrifice spell that kills knee to heal allies. Fuck that. That's like a Hail Mary type of heal spell. We don't want to commit suicide. Chance. Ooh, let's see what these do. Fire, Mega Fire, and Sue and Zan. So Foy is fire, Sue is wind, and Zan is or no, Sue is uh, lightning. Or electricity, or whatever you want to call it. And Zahn is wind. Uh, fuck it, let's try a spell here. I haven't really used techniques a lot yet. Oh, 42 damage, shit! That's what's up. He needs you. Oh shit. Boom. Drop a big tech heal. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Much got two healers because knees got some decent healing as well. A couple buzzers and a poisoner. Poisoner is easy to kill, buzzers are a little stronger. Basically pissed off bees. Getting first strike. We rolled high on initiative. Plot got bit by a spit kill. Dynamite. Right, we need that dynamite to blow up a door on this very same level. They make you walk all the way down there, and then you have to walk all the way back up and around. Typical fantasy star fashion. And we are getting a 
attacked by pulsating globule nasty anuses. I'd like to see a speed run done of this game. Good luck on that. Can't speed run shit through these dungeons. Although there probably is one out there. I could never get into speedruns. I have too much enjoyment out of taking my sweet ass time and reading everything. Nor would I want to practice a game that many fucking times. Unless the game is absolutely amazing, I'm usually one and done in it. Except for these games, of course, which I am replaying for some maybe a second or third time from the time I played in my youth. Uh, but shit, I haven't beat Fantasy Star 2 since it came out. So this is fun as shit. Might as well be a new game to me. But I definitely remember beating Fantasy Star 1, 2, and 3 back in the day. I never did beat 4. I plan on LPing it though, so it'll get done. Then they did this whole Fantasy Star Online shit and just kind of ruined it for me. Um, 1 and 2, definitely my favorites of all time. 3 is pretty cool. 3, where you go through the different generations, I, I kind of like that. Um, but the art style went like a whole new direction so it went for like a more realistic look almost uh, but it's fun as shit actually I'm now I'm kind of getting hyped up to play it I have lots of Final Fantasies to do down the road so many RPGs so little time folks and then I still have new shit to get back to, like Wasteland 2, and then 3 that comes out. Divinity. Pills of Eternity 1 and 2. New Minera. I don't care how bad they suck. I gotta play them. I kickstarted all of them. Probably do unboxings of each of those as well. I will finally break open my signed copies of Pill of Eternity and Torment. All right, here's where we need to use the dynamite. You need to find all the dynamites or you're not getting anywhere. And we just jump down this pit because that shit's fun. Here we are on the sub level. Vortex and Todas, oh my! Damaging floors, fantastic. Blast the masters, holy shit. Oh man, these peckers. This is what killed me last time. Oh, they're gonna make me walk over this shit. That is fucking rude.
Well, I could have went around with that. Whoops. Luckily, it doesn't do much. Try me. <coughs> Excuse me. Paralyzed stock with its armor and asshole assault launcher. Fucking armor ants. Would that be to have armor ants in your pants? That would fucking blow. Get everyone. Everyone healed up. Huh. Except you twat. Fuck you. Minimal damage. That's pretty weak enemies for down here. <coughs> All right, Twat, you gained a level. Let's get you healed up. Touch that Twat stock. She's gonna need it. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, ooh, ah. Oh, ooh. My sound effects are fucking better. Vortex and Toter. Oh, fucked with my agility. Maybe I won't come so quick. Getting the first strike on me. is still level 10? Jesus, what the fuck? <coughs> Four. What the hell is up with that? I think I need to get to this thing. Stock has found the recorder. Okay, now we can actually tech the fuck out of here. There's a poison shotgun in here, not worth getting. Some antidote, not worth getting. We're just gonna warp out. Cock is close. Oh, 
Wait a minute, we're in Paseo, right? How the hell is the... Oh, it warped me back to... Yeah. It warps you back to where you saved last. I got you. It's all right, we're loaded. Got a 12,000... Masetta. Cheaper healing here. Booyah! This must get to the governor. Splendid work, Stock. I will immediately compare the recorder with the library data. I've always believed that Mother Brain is absolutely right all the time, and that our life is protected by Mother Brain. But under the reign of Mother Brain, we've turned into weak and lethargic beings. Under the circumstances, we cannot help realizing the fact. The data must be ready. You better get your ass to the library. Analysis on the recorder has been completed. Oh, that's a bitch. Uh, the cause of the accident in the biosystems lab was an overload of energy poured into the system all at once. As a result, the creature made rapid evolution. This creature does not fit into the cycle of nature, thus should not exist. And because this kind of creature was created, the natural cycles all went out of whack. Please look at the graph. It shows the amount of energy consumed in the last couple of years. Let's overlap the graphs of the temperature and rainfall on it. Holy shit, look at that. As you can see, the energy which was used by the Klamatron to control temperature and rainfall seems to have flowed into the biosystems lab. Biohazard could be something that was schemed up by someone. Please find out why the energy leaked from the Klamatron. Also, if you're going south, take this with you. The bridge over the West River can be passed with this. Good luck. Good luck. How about wanna fuck? My name's Stock. Wanna see my cock? I swear I've never said that to a girl. All right, let's uh, let's let's save again before we head on out of here. Getting notifications on my phone that my uh, eBay orders are here. I got some Reaper miniatures for our D&D session. Got a shit ton of animals. I got like squirrels and turtles and fucking foxes. Wanted just to have the be able to do any regular animal I wanted. And also have them as familiars. So I bought basically all the Reaper familiar packs. And then I got my buddy a thief because he needs a thief. Um, let's see. Ch -ch 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 Sayo. She's gonna get a good night, a good night rest at home. Oh shit, there's a knock at the door again. How do you do, Stock? I'm Hugh Thompson, a biologist. I came when I heard about your quest. I value all life, including bio monsters. I'm willing to fight to defend weaker life forms, though. Perhaps my knowledge will be of help to you. I feel like we are good friends, if you give me a nickname. Oh, you know you're getting one, asshole. Docking. As well as referring to the act of placing the head of an erect penis inside the foreskin slash metis of another erect penis, docking also denotes the act of placing an unerect or flaccid penis along the length of an exposed buttock crack. In this act, often performed in British public boarding schools, Erections are very much frowned upon. In a sentence, Eddie bent over exposing his bumhole with a neatly parted cheek as Tony docked him expertly. Oh, what a beautiful docking, exclaimed Laura. Folks, I welcome to you, Doc. I will call you Doc. Let's check the roster. All right, we're gonna go outside. I don't want to use Doc. I like my super healer chick. 
she keeps me alive in the dungeons when I'm fucking up. So now we need to teleport back to Ofuta. And we have to make a trek back, because now we have the key we need. The key tube. <laughs> I need to come up with one other character that ends in K. And then we'll put them all in the party. We'll have Cock, Stock, Doc, and Block or Rock. I should have called Cock Rock, actually. He's kind of like that big rock guy. The Rock. If we get another rock character, we can call him Rock. But Doc and Cock are penis related. I'm trying to I have a motif here. And I'm penis related because Stock can be a dick. These uh, stingers are pretty badass. They were fucking me up the most out of any of the monsters. And I was grinding. <coughs> Blocking the entrance of the key tube is mosquito and fire ant. Excuse me, the bridge south where we'll use the key tube. Stock puts his key tube inside the keyhole. Somehow it fits. This is Zema, a resort town by the lake. People stopped using any mobile machines after the teleport service was introduced. Oh fuck, he left. <clears throat> we used to play in the ocean on a jet scooter when we were young. What the? been to the southern peninsula. The area smells terrible because of garbage smell from Roran. A lot of fucking fogies here. What the? What? <coughs> ah. What? Huh? What'd you say, honey? Hello, my name is... what? I remember seeing motor people playing on a mobile machine. 
Oh, did people love the garbage dump in Rural Run? Oh, did people make anything from junk? Is that another typo? Okay, no. <clears throat> Font looked a little fucking strange. What the? Around the middle of the lake, there's a tower where nobody ever has been. Huh? Sluglug's grandpa. All right, let's buy shit. It is about fucking time for Ron Stark not to fucking suck. Yeah, I'm gonna buy two. Shit, we can get laser knives for uh, cock as well. Got armor. <clears throat> We're gonna need to probably grind and get some more money because I want to get cock two laser knives as well. Titanium helmet. Holy shit, this stuff's expensive. Goes all my hard earned money. Oh, he already had boots. Fuck. We give the boots to uh, stock. can wear boots as well. Every little bit helps. Well, we need to sell shit, because we're broke now. Folks, that wraps it up for this episode. Stay tuned for more Fantasy Star 2 soon to come.